Imagine nature's two most fearsome predators locked in a brutal showdown. The ruler of the African savanna and the undisputed killer of Asia's dense jungles. Both creatures armed with lethal claws, crushing jaws, and an instinct for battle. Who do you think would win this battle? For centuries, people have debated who is the real king of the jungle. From ancient gladiators in Rome and even the modern experts have tried to determine the victor. Is lion truly the king of the jungle or has the tiger been robbed of this title? Let's break it down. Let's start with the lion. A male lion is a battle-hardened warrior built for endurance and raw strength, weighing between 150 to 250 kilograms and reaching up to 10 feet in length. Lions are powerful fighters, but what truly sets them apart is their thick mane which acts as an armor protecting their neck during fights. Male lions regularly fight other male lions for dominance, making them well prepared for any face-to-face -face combat. Tigers on the other hand are the largest of all big cats. Siberian tigers can grow up to 11 feet long and weigh as much as 320 kilograms, far bigger than a lion. Unlike lions, tigers are solitary hunters. They rely on stealth, power and precision to take down massive prey like a buffalo. They have stronger forelimbs, a deadlier bite of up to 1050 psi of pressure and the lightning fast reflexes that make them lethal killing machines. Their fighting style differs from lions. While lions rely on brute strength and endurance, grappling with their opponents in long drawn out battles while taking hits and keep going. Tigers are assassins. They strike fast, aiming for a killing blow to the throat or a skull and end the battle quickly. History has given us several glimpses of this legendary showdown. In the ancient Roman Colosseums, the gladiators staged battles between lions and tigers. Records show that in those battles, tigers often came out victorious. They usually won using their superior strength and striking power. Zoos and circuses have documented fights where tigers have won most of them. Even though lions have occasionally emerged victorious due to their resilience and endurance. So what happens when these two predators meet? Well, the lion fights to outlast and overpower. Using its thick mane for defense, the tiger likes to end the fight quickly, landing devastating swipes and crushing bites. If the fight drags on, the lion's endurance and battle experience could give it an advantage, especially in an open terrain. But in a head-to-head -head brawl, the tiger's superior strength, size, and agility make it a deadlier opponent. The idea that lion is the king of the jungle comes from its long dominance over the African savanna. If these two apex predators ever meet in a true fight, the tiger would walk away victorious most of the times. So the true king of the jungle throughout the world is not a lion, it is a tiger.